Hey guys, it's Spike here. And I have a question to all believers out there. And I'm hoping to get an honest response. I am an atheist. I do not believe in God. I do not believe in your God. I do not believe in any God. And... But that's not all I believe in. I believe in being a good person. I believe in love. I believe in empathy. I believe in helping others. I believe in all around trying to be the best person you can be. I believe in selflessness. I believe in putting others before yourself. But I also believe in being true to yourself. And not changing because someone else wants you to. If it's who you are. I believe in compassion, I believe in charity, I believe in just about everything that a Christian would say that would make me deserve to walk through the gates of heaven. The one problem is I don't believe in God. You could also consider my stances on other issues, such as homosexuality and abortion. But overall, my heart and my mind is in the right place. I try to understand the world around me. I try to make life as good as possible for those around me. I do my best with what I have. I ask you, do I deserve hell? Do I deserve to suffer eternally for lending a helping hand to those who need it? Do I deserve to burn for talking to people? Do I deserve torture for trying to understand this world the best I can so I can best help those around me? Do I deserve punishment simply for having possibly come to the wrong conclusion? Now some may say that because I don't believe that God could not allow me into his kingdom, but he could. Because I've expressed everything that he has supposedly given me. I've expressed love, I've expressed charity, I've expressed empathy. These are all things said to be from God and I have expressed them. I have loved my neighbor. <sighs> Therefore, if these are the creations of God, I have loved the creations of God and done my best to make lives better for them. So do I deserve to suffer? If I am doing this to things, that, to beings that God loves, am I not doing good unto God? But since I simply do not see the evidence, because I simply see that religion has its evils, I deserve to suffer, apparently. Do I? Do I, an honest person, trying to understand the world around me, trying to make the world a better place, deserve hell. Simply because I cannot find it in me to believe in something that I do not see proof for. Simply because God has led me on these paths. 
because God has sent me where he sent me. Some would argue that they do not know. They do not know where God would send me, and that that's up to God. Honestly, anyone who says otherwise thinks they can know God's will or what God would want is pretty arrogant. You don't know what God would know about my specific situation. It's not as black and white as atheists go to hell and believers go to heaven. <sighs> Everything I've been through is so much more complex. If you were me, you'd understand why I do not deserve hell. If you were in my shoes, you would understand why I do not deserve eternal punishment. I could understand punishment for my wrongdoings, but eternal punishment when I tried my best at life. And I'm not going to lie, it hurts. It hurts that people could think that. It hurts that people could think that I deserve to suffer eternally. It hurts that people don't honestly try to understand where I'm coming from. They simply say, atheist, hell. If there is a God, he knows me. He's put me everywhere I've been, and he's guided me. And it would be because of him and the situations he's put me in, the brain that he's given me, that I am an atheist. I do my best at life. So I ask you, I ask you believers, do I deserve hell?